Friday, you guys. It's maintenance day. I'm going to chop this extremely long hair off. I haven't gotten a haircut since August, so it's time to bring back the layers, bring back some dimension, the curtain bangs. You guys know I love, so let's head on over. This is the hair. If you guys have been following me for a bit, you would know this is like my go-to signature hair. Let's see if this light helps. Okay, yeah, this helps. So you can see like I got the curtain bangs again, and then I just got a bunch of layers, cut off the dead end. So we still kept the length, but no dead end. So very happy with it. Also, I'm loving this little lip combo. I posted a TikTok on it, but let me just get the exact lip gloss. It's from Color Science. I'm obsessed with it. They sent it over to me. Um, this is their Lip Shine. It has SPF in it, which amazing. Like I can't wait to use this in the summer now that I have this. And it says water resistant. What are resistant? I didn't even know that until now. 40 minutes. That's amazing. And this is in the shade pink, but it's just this gorgeous... It's looking a little dark right now because the slate let me turn it you can see it a little better now but it's like this gorgeous pink it actually looks a little lighter um than you probably see on camera but it's like this light pink perfect pink i'm like absolutely obsessed with it i just want to put you guys onto this and show you the new hair i am obsessed but for the rest of the night, I think we're just going to chill at home. We have been obsessed with Dubai Bling. If you haven't seen it before, I highly recommend it. It's hilarious. Everyone's just, it's just really good. Like, to the point, it's so good that Jay, like, was sneaking in watching part of it. And then now he's like, don't watch an episode without me. Because that's how good it is. So, highly recommend just having, like I said, a chill night. Probably going to make some cookies. Just super chill vibes. And then tomorrow we have a date night. And we'll probably get up to a bunch of other stuff as well. happy saturday the weather outside has just been all over the place jay went to walk the dogs it was like 60 degrees super sunny out and he was like hurry up get dressed we're about to go outside it feels like summer and then now it's like super gloomy it even rained for a little and windy so don't know what is going on but i'm about to quickly get ready because we're gonna go downtown and try and get some furniture so as you guys know our apartment's pretty much done like with the basics but i do want to add like some cool decor we also still need a lamp in our living room because now the tree is gone it is just like at night it is way too dark so i really want to get that asap and like i said just like some decor pieces i also want to try and find a few more valentine's day things not really decor but like mugs and stuff like you guys know i love that kind of stuff and knowing me will probably pop into the korean skincare store because i just always need to get more skincare i don't know what it is i'm just obsessed with like trying new things it's my favorite but just gonna quickly do my skincare right now i'm not doing anything crazy like i'm not planning to put on makeup at all really but i'm just gonna go in with these drunk elephant bronzing drops i haven't used them in a bit but I feel like my face just needs a little something. Okay, now it looks like it's gonna pour. And as you guys know, I got my hair done yesterday, so that would not be ideal, but we'll see. Hopefully it doesn't. And then tonight we have dinner reservations at our favorite restaurant ever. We haven't been in a bit, so Jay was like, made us reservations at our favorite place. So get ready for that, which like I said, super excited. So I'm gonna quickly spray my face with this D'Alba spray. I've been loving this. I feel like it just makes your skin super glowy. 
and it smells really good. I got a ton of new makeup in recently. Just a few things that I purchased myself. One is this Hourglass bronzer. Haven't used it yet. Probably use it tonight. And this Dior Backstage Pass. You guys would have seen this on um, my last video. But then today, I also got in two more things I ordered from Sephora. I kind of forgot. These are the Makeup Forever lip liners, which I don't know if I've ever used them. But one is in the shade Chestnut and the other one's Anywhere Caffeine. I've seen everyone rave about these. So I wanted to try them out. For now, I'm just going to go in with my Embryolisse. This is um, a moisturizer I got in France. You can also get it here. Like back when I was in college, I used to love using this also as a primer. It's really great. And then, like I said, just going in with these bronzing drops. Oh, and speaking of new makeup, I also got this Kosas Cloud Set. This is their Bake Setting and Smoothing Powder. I've heard great things about it, so I think I may go over what I'm about to put on with this just to, you know, make sure everything is locked in place. Let's see what this does for me. Okay, I think that bronzed up my face a little bit. I'm just gonna go in with a little of this Merit Brow. This is in the brown shade. Also, if you guys are wondering what that is back there, it's a humidifier. Past like week, I've just had the worst migraines, like sinus pressure migraines. And so I think it could be related to just like the humidity. I have no idea, but that's what everyone suggested to me. So I figured I would try it out. I also just kept waking up with nosebleeds. So I was like, you know what? Let me just get us a little one. I also need to get one out there for the dogs. Now I know I said I was gonna go in with too much makeup, but I feel like I just need to go in with a little concealer just to conceal these crazy dark circles. And a little on the sides here. I just feel like a little concealer goes a long way. I've been loving this House Labs one like nonstop. I've been using this. And you guys know I absolutely love my Kosas ones. These are like great for the no makeup, makeup natural looks. They're both very creamy, which I love. <music> I'm gonna go in with the Kosas. They sent me this in the shade Pillowy. It says it's a sheer, medium, tan, transparent bronze. This is what the inside looks like. I feel like this would be a perfect shade for me. Just gonna dab that in. Oh, this is really pretty. Definitely does what it says. Translucent, but it doesn't get rid of the glow. And since I put that on, I am gonna go in and set my face a little. This is just my go-to Charlotte Tilbury um, setting spray. It's called the Airbrush Flawless Setting Spray. I absolutely love it. Now I'm gonna go in with one of these liners just because I wanna try it out. I think I'm gonna go in with the Anywhere Caffeine, which is the lighter one. So far I'm really loving this liner. It kind of feels like a pencil, so it's really easy to use. Now, like I said, going in with the pink, what is this, pink sugar. Okay, I think that's like the perfect natural lip combo. It's really pretty natural lip combo. Makeup overall very natural and we are ready to head out we're back home i surprisingly didn't buy anything which if you guys know me, they usually end up coming home with something, but we literally purchased nothing. We did go to Scar's Pizza, which is pretty good. But now I'm just going to get ready. Like I said, we do have dinner. I think I'm going to film it right here on my TikTok. So I hope this light isn't annoying for you guys. <laughs> my battery died as it was just finishing this is the finished look what do you guys think 
went for a very glowy look as you guys saw i used this magic serum kind of as a primer and i really love it i see the hype now very much see it um my lip combo i have it posted of course but it's just this anywhere caffeine um makeup forever lip liner love this and then this is just the hourglass uh haze i think this is like i don't know how to explain it but it's like a lipstick gloss type thing now i'm just going to figure out my outfit we have to leave in like 20 minutes so gotta hurry up and get on that quickly wanted to show you guys my outfit before we headed out i'm just wearing this blue sweater from uniqlo it's like a knitted sweater i'm sorry you can't see because I need to clean this mirror clearly but it's just like this cute knitted sweater and then for pants i'm just wearing these mango ones you guys have seen me wear these a million one times they're super comfortable still have not gotten them tailored but it's fine and then my go-to tony bianco boots and i was debating between pairing this with my chanel since it's blue but I feel like the black Prada bag kind of goes with it a little more and it ties in the boots and everything. But that's my final look. Of course, putting a jacket on over this because it's cold outside, but I'll catch up with you guys when we're there. having a super chill last few days as you saw we did a lot on saturday but yesterday pretty much did nothing and then today i'm off because it's martin luther king jr day which i knew it was but for some reason i didn't know it was off my company's like kind of weird like we're not always off on days everyone else is off so i hope i am off today but I looked it up. It said I should be off, so I should be good. But yeah, today we're having another chill day. It's been freezing out. Yesterday we had some sort of like snow, squail, I don't even know how to pronounce it. Something of that sort. And now all the birds are bugging out, so I don't know if that means it's going to snow or rain. Like, it's just been all over the place, the weather. Apparently we're supposed to get a lot of snow tonight. And then I think again in two days, so. Hopefully it's enough to like actually be on the ground. It's not too much, but just like a nice little dusting. But today this is going to be another chill day. I'm probably going to edit a lot today. And then I also wanted to film a few makeup videos. As you guys know, I've been really into filming makeup skincare videos. So I wanted to get a few up today. But yeah, I think that's what I'm going to get up to today. Jay is working. He works pretty much every holiday at this point then tonight i think i'm gonna try and go get a pedicure i was gonna try and go get my nails done because as you can see still have my christmas nails but the lady who usually does my nails isn't in today she's in starting tomorrow we have a vet appointment tomorrow with simba so i think i'm gonna try and make that appointment sometime later this week before today definitely think i'm gonna go get a pedicure i did just get a pr package in so i figured i'm gonna share with you guys what i got this is from yensa beauty i've never tried any of their stuff before but they reached out so I was excited to try. It says they're creating a new era of beauty by combining modern superfood science with tried and true powerful Asian rituals. So I'm very excited about this. You guys know I love Korean skincare. I love just trying new things. And if this is a beauty product, I think that's right up my alley. So they send over a ton of stuff. First thing is the silk bronzing base, which this sounds amazing. Just like anything with the word silk and then especially silk and bronzing. I'm sold. Let's open this up and see. I love the packaging too. It's gorgeous. Wow, this looks like it's going to be stunning. I'm very excited to use this. This is like the perfect shade for me. I believe they sell these products at like Nordstrom. I'll try and have everything linked down below, but very excited to try. Oh, they also sent over brushes. I didn't even see that. Then they sent over their Super Serum Silk Cream Blood. Oh, this is beautiful. Look at how gorgeous that is. Next, we have their Super Serum Silk Foundation. They sent over like this little one. It has vitamin C and E, ferulic, and bacuchiol. I probably pronounced that wrong, but excited to try this. Their Super Serum. Wait, they sent me, sent me this in a small one and a big one. Because then I have the bigger foundation here. Oh, this is really pretty. 
Hopefully this matches my skin tone. I feel like it will. And then like I said, they also sent over their Super Serum Silk Concealer. This has vitamin C and E, ferulic acid. Very gorgeous concealer. This concealer looks like it's going to be perfect. We all have to do like a full face of Yunsa Beauty for my TikTok. And this is their primer, Essential Glow Primer. Ooh, I love this. They sent over two brushes very pretty brush and the brush feels very soft too so this will just be perfect one is a foundation brush and this is a complexion brush it says best used with powder cream or liquid products very nice I love the shape of these. Excited about this. Again, thank you so much, Yensa Beauty. But like I said, now I think I'm just going to start editing. Maybe I should film some videos first. I don't know. Well, we'll figure it out. I just filmed a bunch of videos. I feel very productive because like I said, this is my off day from work for Martin Luther King Jr. Day. But I think I'm gonna make myself a little something to eat because it's already, what time is it? Almost three o'clock and all I've had today is cereal. Not great at all. I was just really craving this like Chex Honey Nut Gluten Free Cereal, but I really need to have some protein in my body, eat something. So I'm about to figure out what I'm gonna make and then I think I may go get a pedicure. Not sure yet. <laughs> been a few days i'm actually about to start getting ready for an event i just finished work it's wednesday by the way in case you were wondering but i just figured i would include this in this little weekend vlog because i thought this would be a fun little event to take you guys to I feel like i haven't gone to like an event event in a while honestly i don't think i've gone to one since like new york fashion week now that i think about it i'm excited for this event it's actually with our building the owners of our building so our building owns like a ton of apartment buildings across all of new york city all boroughs i believe tonight's event is at one of their newest buildings in Brooklyn. So I'm just about to quickly get ready for that. My hair is not looking too great. It's definitely time for wash, which I think I'll do like a full hair oiling routine tonight and maybe I'll film that for you guys as well. Definitely film me for TikTok, but I have to remember to do it on here as well. I don't know if I should just put my hair in a bun or what I should do. I think I'm gonna try and do rollers, just like in the front pieces, and then maybe just use the Dyson attachment to curl. I really don't have that much time at all, because I think we're supposed to be there. Well, it'll take us like 40-ish minutes to get there, so I just wanna make sure we're there on time and everything. It's supposed to be, I think it's like a flower workshop, and they're gonna have wine, and then I believe catering by Maman, so I am excited about that. But like I said, I'm just going to quickly start getting ready and of course I'll take you guys along to the event. makeup and i'm not gonna lie i kind of hate it i don't know what i did differently but I feel like it just looks cakey and like not my vibe at all but i don't have time to redo this whole thing so we're just gonna go like this i just need to quickly do the lips hopefully this will help do something okay the lips definitely help just need to take out all these rollers also just wanted to quickly show you guys this is my this is my new go-to natural lip combo the summer fridays pink sugar lip balm and then this is the makeup forever anywhere caffeine love this liner let me just take these out because i need to in five minutes and i'm not even dressed yet okay yes the rollers definitely helped a lot but i still feel like this part of my hair needs a bit more like volume or something so just gonna quickly go over this one piece okay everything looks a lot better i need to hurry up and get dressed this is the outfit i decide on for tonight i just wanted to wear something comfortable it's that time of the month super bloated so i just wanted to wear something that wouldn't be super tight on me so i'm wearing this sweater i got from mango it's really comfortable and i love the color and then i'm just wearing also these pants from mango these are like trouser type pants you guys definitely see me wear these a bunch then just pair it with my tony bianco boot and my little anthro purse of course i'm gonna bundle up because it's absolutely freezing 
freezing outside. We walked to the mall a little earlier and the wind was just smacking me in the face. I'm a little nervous that all this makeup is just gonna come right off my face. Hopefully it doesn't. Like I said, I'll take you guys along with us as usual. just got home I wanted to show you guys our little floor arrangements tell me who you think it's better comment down below which one you think is better because Jay swears this is better so I'll show you mine first are you gonna show yours this is mine look at how gorgeous she is I'm very proud of her they didn't give me many tips they had to constantly give Jay tips and he also spilled half bitches now wow look at that look at the proportions you have the <laughs> the colors kind of contrasting with each other. Then you have these sticking out perfectly. You have your hero flowers right in the middle. Oh yeah, he listened to everything, but I think mine is the better one. And then in case you guys want to know where we got our flowers from, we got them from Pick and Petal. I'll put their info right here. But they were so sweet and they have the most gorgeous flowers. I absolutely love this. On the way back, Jay was saying, I wonder how much it is for us to like do an event like this because we would love to, like just with like, I don't know, our closest friends, maybe family. Like, it was just a lot of fun to be, you know, sipping wine, having a little snack. They had, like, a bunch of stuff. My mom catered. And then to make these beautiful floor arrangements. It was a lot of fun. And then we also got to view one of our buildings, one of our buildings owners new building so like the building we live in they have like i said a bunch of buildings around new york city and so we got to view one of their newest buildings in brooklyn so gorgeous if you love our apartment this one is like significantly nicer like let me tell you they have a pool they have a rooftop a rec room it's a super cute neighborhood very like neighborhood vibes but there's like so many restaurants and stuff to go around the new chelsea pierce is right next to it the sickest views of manhattan like absolutely gorgeous so if any of you guys are interested definitely reach out to me because i can refer you so just putting that out there let me know also put this on my instagram but yeah we had a fun night and now we're just gonna get ready to go to sleep